Okay, well, it's recovery morning after a, a Sunday in Adelaide. Uh, Chris Yaram, welcome to CFC TV. What have you done today? A bit of a recovery session? Yeah, we had a bit of a sleep in today, considering we got, uh, got in at 10.30 last night from uh, Adelaide. Uh, so 11.30 started recovery, so just uh, 10 minutes on the bike and then checking in on the dock, so we were all clear and injuries and stuff. So, um, yeah, that's probably the positive thing out of the game. We had no injuries. Well, that's a very good point. Um, tell us about the game. You only played the second. What was it like? Pretty warm over there, pretty humid, I believe, as well. Uh, it was pretty humid. Uh, coming from Melbourne, obviously, never had a, a really hot summer to go over in Adelaide and, and play. Uh, yeah, you know, it was 30, 33 plus degrees over there. It was pretty difficult, but um, yeah, so we just had to adapt to the to weather, I guess. Th Thankful enough, the quarters were only 15 minutes, so in, in that regard, it was probably a, a good thing to play two 15 minute halves. And for you, uh, at a rest for the first one, came out fresh in the second game and got plenty of the ball. Uh, good to get out there again? Uh, it was actually pretty good. Not playing the Inter Club uh, the week before, um, you know, I had a pretty good hit out and I was pleased with my effort on the weekend. So um, disappointing we lost, but it was all about uh, getting the younger guys out there and, and Joshy Bootsmer, uh, Dylan Buckley and you know, uh, Fraser as well. So um, that was probably the main thing we got out of it, just to play a few of the younger guys who was fighting for spots this year. And, uh, you know, frustrating we lost, but you know, that's, a, that's, that's footy, I guess. I guess that's the thing. I mean, you always want to go out and win, but at the end of the day, I think the coach had a big say too, and, and as far as time management, as, as Brett Ratton pointed out. But you still want to win, don't you? When it gets down to it, you say, oh, pity we lost. But at the end of the day, it doesn't mean anything towards the real season. Uh, I don't think so. I think you shouldn't read much into, into that game. I guess um, you know, we'll, we'll um, look at what we've done wrong. And you know, we had a pretty young, young side in, in both games. Um, we rested a few, a few players, a few of our senior players. So um, you know, we'll, we'll put a full strength in next week against the Bulldogs and uh, hopefully uh, get the result that we're after. Full strength, although uh, the, we're still a bit of we're not sure whether Judd will play and a couple others, but um, it's important, isn't it? These games are all about getting ready for the season proper and making sure the team and individuals are ready to go round one. Yeah, so Judd is in a few weeks away, but um, you know when he comes back, he'll be hopefully cheer you up for round one, I guess. Um, yeah, so you know we're, we're just playing kids in the NAB Cup, and you know hopefully they can get as much out of themselves and hopefully uh, you know press for the senior selection in round one and and in season, so um, that's what we're all about at the moment, time management and stuff like that, so um, no, Ratch is a smart guy, he's, um, he's got his head around all that sort of stuff, so. Excellent, well Yaz, uh, I know you're nearly finished for the day, it's been a quiet day, have a rest because I know there'll be plenty of training this week and get ready for the Bulldogs on Sunday. Alright, thanks mate.